we have kind of a big shakeup starting off this new year. This is a timeless reading, but as of the recording, we just started a new year. Yeah, hence the jacket. Anyway, whatever. Hi, I'm Michelle. This is Angel Souls. Thank you so much for being here. First card out right here is transformation. That's what's happening. And it's transformation on such a large scale that we are not even going to be recognizing the world we live in. Now, that doesn't have to be in this crazy way. The next card is Guardian Angel. So it, it does show that this is a necessary transformation. This is something that is guided. We need to make this happen. But this really does take us not accepting things that we have always accepted. Pick a human atrocity. Can't accept those anymore. There are some that are subtle. I put up a video on TikTok because there was this trend going around about parents busting into the house, dressed as the Grinch, terrifying their kids. And honestly, if you just sat there and laughed, these kids were absolutely in terror. It's sad and it's weird that people think it's funny to terrorize kids for a laugh. But that has been so commonly accepted, hasn't it? So we didn't even see it. It's stuff like that where we normalize these horrible things because maybe they were done to us. Or you think that you're toughening up your kids. <sighs> Let kids be kids. Okay, so... We have gratitude and then we have co-creation going on here. So we start off this year with quite a bit of, like I said, a shakeup, a rumble. I hope that doesn't mean an earthquake, but have gratitude for what is already in place, what we already have. And I mean that. So no more complaining. And if you really are having a hard time working through a situation, something that just keeps, you know, resurfacing for you, then it's time to talk to somebody, like a therapist. And I mean that. It's time to talk to somebody because you complaining about things is not going to bring any resolution. You understanding yourself and understanding what you're trying to get out is going to help you, okay? And then we have co-creation. So on this card, there is a heart there. So this is creating from the heart space. But you have to be in touch with your compassion in order to be able to create. That's why I was given that example about the Grinch thing. There was this whole trend, I think it's still there, where there's the dancing cactus. When you talk to it, it starts dancing. And people sitting that in front of babies and the babies bursting into tears because they're scared. They're scared. They're distressed about what this is. And parents just standing there laughing and letting their kid, yeah, no, I'm not being too sensitive. This is exactly the type of thing that we are talking about here. It is not funny to terrorize anybody, to bully anybody in any way. It is not okay to be hateful. It is not okay to try to assert your power over someone else. There is so much going down. And I want to use the word revolution. And we have the passion card here. So this is Archangel Haniel. Haniel is all about the divine feminine. And compassion coming back. Compassion coming back. Because that has been... Compassion has been trying to be like pushed out. Like, you know, whether it's through a narrative, brainwashing. Um, like the narrative, oh, what's the big deal? Oh, it's so funny that these kids are terrified. It would be funny if it was an adult, <laughs> like somebody came, like if I'm sitting here and somebody came in dressed as the Grinch and took my tree, I'd be like, what? <laughs> but, like, but I'm in a space, I'm old enough where I can handle it. These are little kids, okay, who think that this is real. So they're really being traumatized or at least scared, okay? Not okay. Okay, not okay. <laughs> That's what I just said. But anyway, uh, the divine feminine, having a passion from the divine feminine and div divine feminine qualities as well. Trust and follow your renewed passion in your love life and career. I mean, again, I think that's kind of a dangerous message at this time because people being encouraged to obsess over, the, it doesn't say obsess, but like we do, don't we? Over their career, love life, whatever. Those are all things that, yes, as humans, those are important things to focus on. 
And yet my hair gets caught on this jacket, something fierce. It's crazy, but <laughs> the jacket's getting caught on itself, but whatever. We pull it out once a year. That's all. So anyway, you know, this whole thing of getting so focused and distracted by day-to-day -day things in your life, you're getting distracted from the real transformation. You're getting distracted from what really needs our time and attention, and that is humanity. And don't forget the whole reason why many of us incarnated was to help humanity. And if we're going to play along with these atrocities, if we're going to allow things to happen to kids, then we're not doing our job. And this is the time to realize what we need to do as an individual and as a collective and to start taking action on that. All right. So angelsouls444.com if you'd like a personal reading with me. And always check out the description box because I do live events where you can come, ask me questions. We can interact. So check it out. We're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care. Bye.